Of course, great table tennis fans here in Shanghai and throughout China. And to see world stars like Timo Ball performing here once again is a real delight. Well, of course, Timo Ball is a massive star. I hope he doesn't pull his back out the way he's throwing those. But it's a good warm up for him for his back hands in the match. I am, of course, assuming that he. He is playing, but of course he might not be. So Don thanks Timo for participation there with the crowd again. Fantastic interaction here in this event, trying to create a different environment for the sport of table tennis, promoted in a slightly different way. It's the reason for having Don Wang there doing the entertainment, talking to the players, no coaches. The world team choosing the players from China that they play against. Great spectacle, great enjoyment, great fun for everybody here. And it's great to see our sport of table tennis displayed and put on in this way. A great show, a showcase in fact. And it is Timo Ball for this men's singles. It's Dimitri Arturov. I try my best, I catch a little cold a few days ago, but I had confidence in uh, 2008 I could beat him last time and I was looking forward to meeting him one more time. Right. And he says, although he's caught a little bit of a cold in the last couple of days, Dmitry Ovtyarov, he does feel confident that he wants to give a go against Wang Li Ching. So he's choosing Wang Li Ching because he felt he could beat him in 2008. He has a chance here. What does Wang Li Ching say? So Wiley Ching says there's no pressure on him. China leading 3 0. Can the men finish in style as the Chinese women have? Wang Lichin also saying that he's from Shanghai, this is his home turf. So he feels that it may give him an advantage and he wants to bring home the victory. He's looking forward to a good match, as are we. <laughs> Legends of the game, Wang Lichin and Dmitry Ovtyarov in fact moving in that way, still very young. These players have played three times in total. And it's Wang Li Qin who leads 2-1. And again, Ovtyarov was referring to the battle that they had in the 2008, which was their last encounter in the Korean Open. Dimitri said there in the field of play when interviewed by Dong that he felt he had a chance, and he did in the early stages of that match, but it was, uh, well, it was Dimitri Ovtyarov who went on and won 4-1, actually. So he won the last encounter, Dmitry Ovtyarov, but Wang Li Ching leads 2-1 overall, so this is feeling like it's evenly balanced. There is Wang Li Ching, 34 years old from Shanghai, world rank number nine at the moment. He has played twice in this event in 2009, 2010. He's 25 times winner on the world tour. Between 1996, when he first won his first in Lyon, France, and his last in 2012 in Qatar. And there is the world number 11, 24 year old Dmitry Ovtyarov. He was the bronze medalist in the London 2012 Olympic Games of both singles. And the team event. Four time winner on the world tour. First time in 2010 in New Delhi. Last time, recently there in Bremen, he won the German Open when he defeated Timo Ball, his compatriot, and his team. Colleague here in the World Team Challenge match. Wang Li Qin won the grand finals three times in Beijing 2004, Japan 2000. Back in 1998, he won that accolade in France. He's three times world champion. 2007, Zagreb. 2005, Shanghai. And 2001, Osaka, Japan. 
which was actually my last World Championships as a player. Fantastic event and a member at Wales. But the one tournament, the one medal, the one championship that Wiley Jean hasn't managed to win is the World Cup. Maybe at 34 years of age and still representing China. Maybe that's the target for this amazing legend of the game as he keeps going. With all the support, of course, in sport these days, and table tennis is no different. All the support from masseurs and physiological support and training techniques and recovery strategies and food and everything else these players can prolong their careers so what's in store here it's Ocherov to serve first it's game one the place. Wonderful stuff, very solid from Wang Li Chin. A little bit of a smile, I think, on both players. They enjoyed that. What an opening we had there. Sets the tone for the match. Leg. Love one. Of course, off to off. Service technique we're used to now on the world circuit. Great to see players being innovative using new techniques, new ways of trying to create a little bit of an advantage in their style, in their game. 24-year-old German certainly knows how to do that. Serves into the net, gives Ofterov his first point, and serves back to him at 1 3. <laughs> spins into his backhand, very comfortable on the counter. Top spin on the backhand side, as well as the forehand is Dmitry Ofterov. <laughs> Two here in the opening game. This one is playing reasonably well, though. <laughs> Needs to make those ones count. Keeps his legs almost in the same position, good position that it is. Allows him to power around the court, both on the backhand but mainly on the forehand side. And he's able to get the forehand in, keep pressure on his opponent. Very impressive strength and power. Chinese player here in game 
one. And five. That through the rest of the match. Selecting the players for this, obviously, feel the same. And Ma Lin, over 30, Ma Lin, 32 years old. So Wang Li Ching picks us off in game two. And followed by a strong forehand topspin winner. We'll be able to see the footwork of Wang Li Ching from this camera angle. One all. Great disguise. Concentration. And again with a Perhaps Dimitri just signals. Needs to keep that one down nice and low. Forehand right down. Oh. So good to get that one back. So looking solid here, Wang Li Ching. After all, just needs to try and get himself into it a little bit. We all know how much power he has, both on the backhand and forehand sides. If he can just play himself into it. Wang Li Ching is very secure at the moment in terms of his receive his ability to get his top spins in there's another one this time he's going to need all his strength and if he is suffering from a cold as he said before the match he's going to have to battle it out here Three. Six three. Three seven. Good serves for my meeting, changing where he 
put such a change in the spin that he imparts in the ball. at every event and to plan the schedule well enough and be convinced enough in your own mind where your peaks are in the season where your training plan supports that and your event calendar it's their livelihood after all and there are crowds around the world that are delighted to see them Always keen to entertain and put on the best show possible, which they certainly have done here in Shanghai. in the first game and the first half of this second game. She played his way into this one, Dmitry Ovtorov. He's done well. See how Wang Lichin reacts. He was looking comfortable up until a few moments ago. Nine all. I know. Ovtorov served to come. Pushes into the net. Game point for Ofterov for the world team here. with the backhand, which might not be conventional methods, but it's certainly very effective and used more and more in the modern game. Great dig there, long with a bit of spin, and a wonderful backhand top spin. From off to off to secure game two.
Close game. Archimov will serve. Lower. Dmitry will serve. Let's see how this match will unfold. Great to see both players focused and in the zone to win, even though the overall match is personal. Forehand flick after a topspin serve there from off to up. He's played his way into this. Stay focused. He's kept believing. Petrov still managed to find a way battle through, but watch this from Wang Yuting right onto the white line. That is superb. It's precision. Table tennis right there. Again, of off draw, but this time with the reverse spin. Three, cool. Great man to flick into the forehand of Dmitry off draw. Wang Lee chains up for it. On that occasion, just keep the net from the German. Three, all. So one all and three all. <laughs> on the floor, warming the muscles up, progressed into running, jogging, stretching, and then as soon as he was on the table you could tell he was a man that meant business going through his drills, warming up each of his shots, routines. <laughs> the last point, fantastic athleticism, throws himself into his forehand topspins. for someone who's closer to my age at 34. I'm impressed. Again, a brave man that goes long into the Wang Li Chin forehand. I guess he positioned that well enough that it was in the middle, into the body of Wang Li Chin, so not just as straightforward to attack. Certainly a tactic, I think, for off to off. In terms of the spin and the position, it's crucial to keep the opponent guessing. And then both players more than capable of playing aggressive top spins on both sides. Following the serves. Six five. Enjoy this evenly poised <coughs> once again. <coughs> Players take the towels, as of course they're allowed to. Every six points. I always wonder what's going through the minds of players at this stage. I think both will be focused on executing good service routines. Be aggressive where they can. Off to 
Kirov was battling. Fished it back up. Wonderful counter of Topspin on the forehand side. Forced the top edge, the timing on the Wang Chin forehand. 7 6. Slender lead here. short on the forehand, just popped, and that is great balance, timing, and technique to play that shot. Maybe those are the risks that he feels he needs to take. He's given himself a two-point cushion here at 6-8. Oh, what completely himself right into this match. Wang Lee Chin will be thinking, happened in the last game and a half. He looked invincible. After off a little bit wayward, but the tables have turned a slight bit here. Oh. Solid play from the three times world champion. Serve short into the forehand, followed up by and forehand topspins. Wang Li Ching, one of very his serves too. And as we see, his strengths, he wants to play. Those forehands, it is. Wang Li Ching, strong base. Very difficult for him to lose his balance. Very good, strong, solid position to move left to right, short and long. Never seems to look out of position. Sometimes to put the player off who's hit the net in the end. Seen it happen many a time. Thank <laughs> you. 
table, having flicked over the table, can then exert serious amounts of speed and topspin, and topspin movement. when the team was looking as if he was getting some momentum in this game. frustration there. Perhaps feels that his momentum has certainly been stopped since we saw him dominating the first game. He want to play himself now back into this match. He want to finish it in style. Flowing top spins. For the fast long serve there, expecting to be able to play smoothly into the rally. After off, he's aggressive. And back at him. Gives himself one point lead to German. Top spin there off to off the ground together. Left the whole table exposed though. Quite an easy one. Only the team wasn't for making any errors. And so a match here that's hugely dependent on. The server serving well and attacking the third ball. Both players doing exceptionally well. Point advantage, 6-5. Court <laughs> perhaps. Seven five needs this game to take it to a decider. Uh, from China, who said there was no pressure on him at the start of this match. Of course, he's right. China are leading 3-0. to absorb that, but nonetheless, well executed. Off guard. Nice change by Wangley Team. Clappers, create some noise, 
as they eagerly await the deciding game in this last match here in the Minhang Gymnasium in Shanghai. China leading 3-0 overall. What doesn't seem to matter to either player. This seems to be very much a singles duel. Both player won the secure victory. Finally chained a secure 4-0 overall victory for China. And Dmitry Ovchov, who will kick us off with serve here, wanting to put some pride on the table from the world team. <laughs> strong points at the beginning of this fifth and deciding game. And 3-0. Off to signals for timeout. So wants 60 seconds to regroup. Displaying his disappointment a little bit to Timo Ball there. Going 3-0 down in the deciding game. Timo not giving Winning the second and third games, as we see on screen. And the Chinese team will be encouraging Wang Li Qing to continue as he has started this fifth. Three love. So Wang Li Chin with the second of his two serves in this sequence at three zero. Five points reached by Wang Li Qing in the deciding game. So the players change ends. Enough to roll his way back into this one. And as Wang Li Qing set sail. It did all the damage, and the fist says it all. A little bit of relief, perhaps, as well, that he's got a little bit of breathing space at 6 0. After a third of bronze medalist in the singles in London, the Olympic Games won't want to give this up too easily. <laughs> Shot cross court. 
to watch you off, off the mark here. Next. Six one down though. Six one. Change it up a little bit and maybe give something to finally change to think about. 7 3. Holly! Need to stay concentrated. Serves here, Dimitri. Off to rough. And it's match point now for Wiley Chin. Let. Three pin. Maybe he's suffering a little bit physically if he does have a date to go. But nonetheless, put up a great fight and a clinical finish by Wiley Chain. 11 points to 3 in the fifth game there. And Don Wang's just going to have a quick word with Wiley Chain. Reflecting on the game when he goes a little bit behind on the third ball attacks, the pressure that 